and welcome back to TFS Plays Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 3. Trace. I'm the Lanny reference. I am Gr Car Grant, Grant, or Grant, Grant, character Grant. So here's a mode I forgot existed in this game okay. that I thought was hilarious as a kid. Uh, let's see. Chi Chi has basically the list of all the characters. You can look at them and be like, hey, let's look at their character. You can hear their voice. You can view their model. Oh my you can God. Also, Hear what Chi Chi's got to say about them. So we got like, or herself sometimes in relation to them. But it's great because she has something for everyone. So let's just see. What, yeah, let's go random. What, what's she have what's to say, she say about great ape, ape turtles? What's Chi Chi's thoughts? Yep, he turns into an ape. Thanks. Good, Chi -Chi. good, good call. I, I need. What, what do you got to say about Cell? Per perfect what do you have to say about Perfect Cell? I don't know what he means by perfect, but it looks like he's gotten strong. Yeah. Thanks, Chi Chi. Good, good, I, th good. I thought there'd be something about it, like he's fighting my baby yeah, boy. Yeah, not my boy. But like, I just like go into like the really obscure, weird, like Salsa. Yeah, let's let's hear what she has to say what about it. What you gotta say? How do you know who Cooler is? <laughs> well, let's, let's see, see what she's she got to say about Cooler. About cooler. This is Cooler, Freeze's older brother. Ah, she knows. She knows mm. the age. I, I feel like she's just giving a brief synopsis. Like, it's not so much commentary. Like I've got, I've got a uh, you know Zangya. Oh wow! She don't go out with this woman. Wow, you know a lot about her. <laughs> she knew way more about her than I was expecting. I <laughs> but I just thought that it's hilarious that she's just like doesn't matter who it is. I thought it'd be something like I always knew Vegeta was a baby. <laughs> He's still mean, but uh, I think my favorite might be uh, as as you go through the Super Saiyan ones, she naturally does the oh what a delinquent. Yeah. Uh, whoops. And then by the time you get to uh, Super Saiyan 3. I don't want to see Super Saiyans anymore. <laughs> I think everybody felt the same. Thanks. We're, we're done with them. But anyway, I thought that was fun. Wanted to highlight that before we jumped back into the dragon history. Yeah, back where we left off. I Hopping. think we have new. Uh, we got new movies. Yeah, we got new movies that we can look at. Oh, wow. Straight to sell. Wow. Well, you know. Not, not shocking. It went straight to Frieza. Whoop. The weak against the sound sounds of whistling. whistling. Only specifically Namekian slugs, though, it says Krillin. I mean, I guess they're all slugs. I mean, uh, Namekian crabs Ooh. aren't weak to it. All right, okay. So the so the race are not Namekians. They are Namekian slugs, slugs. I guess. To leave this planet in peace. We didn't get to see that part. <laughs> Yeah, Bryce. I miss you, Bryce. Every other every other non-character in Yu Yu Hakusho. Yeah. Can you just be a generic demon number four? Thank you. Got it, Bryce. Can you be this pirate captain? <laughs> Can you be this assassin? Sure. I'll sail them to the... Uh, what's the name of the island Dark Tournament's on? Uh, Hanging Neck Island Hanging or something Neck like island, that. Something like that. I'll be the captain on that ship. I'll also be like 80% of the demons they fight. Oh, that's your messy. He's the one who's what beat the Tagaro brothers. I heard they took out the Triad gang. Well, that's weird. He has such a beautiful voice. I forgot, because uh, I recently watched some of the Dark Tournament, I forgot how almost... Ununderstandable gin can be at times. Oh, yeah, sure, man. She got to pay for a bad fit, but just, like, large, like, just up the Gaelic by like 80%. <laughs> just, you don't need bombs to go boom in your face. You're a messy. <laughs> what are you fucking wackos? <laughs> Thanks, Windmaster. You, uh. He's so great eloquent. character, though. Oh, yeah, he's great. I, I never listened to the Japanese, so I've never, like... I also watched it uh, with subs for a little bit, and I surprisingly really liked it a lot, because I feel like it changes the story a bit, because all the characters sound significantly younger, and it makes everything feel way more terrifying, because you're like, these are children fighting in this tournament. Yeah, I remember, like, I, I remember not digging Japanese Kuwabara, because I'd gotten so used to Sabbats, and the Japanese one is so different. Yes, very. And, like, I, I love the dub. I'm not discounting it at all, but... With the dub, I think somewhere along the line, I forgot they're supposed to be like 14. Yeah, Yusuke Urameshi, age 14. Yeah, he's like he's like 15 at the Dark Tournament yeah. or something like that. 16 by the time he's fighting Chapter Black. 
And he's a senior. He's supposed to be like a senior in high school when he's <laughs> trying to rule the demon world. <laughs> yeah, like it. It puts things into a very different perspective when they have like you know a, a girl doing his voice. Yeah, it's a shame that sh like I feel like that show kind of fell apart after Chapter Black. It really did. It's a real shame because it was like my favorite. When it's good though, I still think it is one of the best. So I eat a dicks. I Log. thought I thought he was gonna win that exchange. I'm real glad he didn't. Oh, is this the first one that had a giant Namekian? I think so. No, oh, he's even got the little slash on his eyelid. At least the anime ended better than the manga did, though. The manga was weird. Oh, did it? I never even checked out. There's the manga. a whole extra arc. Oh, really? Yeah, wow, it got hundred hundred. No Has to do with like spirit rangers and Koenma's dad coming back. It's weird. Oh, I saw the. Uh, there, there are two movies for Yu Yu Hakusho, right? There's the. Yeah, there's the uh, Seal of Fire and the one that's commonly referred to as the Poltergeist Report, despite that yeah. just being an alternate title, tri title uh, an alternate translation to Yu Yu Hakusho. So I know there was like a movie that was released later, dubbed. Like, I don't know. I feel like it just didn't get made for a while or something. Yeah, the Seal of Fire was... It, it was like one of those like half-hour anime movies that's more like an OVA yeah. than a movie. I think that's the one I had. And if I recall correctly, I got it because it came like packaged with a movie called Ninku. Maybe that that's what, what I'm thinking. No, maybe not. I don't know. All I know is I remember I had some movie that wasn't like the movie that you abridged, and I was like, this seems less good. Yeah, it wasn't good. Like that's why I oh, never touched right. it. I'm like, what am I doing? What, what what would I do with this? Because <laughs> I was thinking about doing that for like my, I think it was like, at the time, either ten thousand or twenty thousand subscriber special or something like that. But I'm like, ah, I'm just gonna skip to the good movie. <laughs> I don't care if this one's more in timeline with where I'm at. The other movie's just better. Back away from me, slug, so I can charge up. That and it allowed me to write for Hinageshi, which was my favorite character to write forever. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing like a cloud cuckoo lander. I believe is the trope. Jesus. That does so much damage. This is ridiculous. Ow, 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 ow. I mean, maybe you will. Go! Ah. Now fly back into it. No. Come on, Get back not? away, Goku, please. I want you to fly quickly backwards. Nope, that's into him. I wonder if the form Super Saiyan had been introduced, like, in the manga before this, before movie, this movie came out. I don't know. Because you could tell that they were playing around with that, like, yeah. halfway form. He's like, Super Saiyan, but not quite. Jesus. Does so much damage. That's why we're gonna do it again. Well, Got there him. we go, we won. And that's how Slug died. Goku just used Kamehameha and it was nothing. I did it! Yeah! Give him the thumbs up. Goku! Don't you come near me, Krillin. You stay over there. You too, Gohan. You stay back. N nobody else enter the scene. You did really good there, Goku. Goku, he really could be a super saiyan. No, well, I already did I that already part. I already have done that. I did that part already. I forget at what point you start unlocking like the uh, what if scenarios with like Devil Man and stuff. Oh wow, I forgot about that. Yeah, the best what if scenario where all the villains come and Devil yeah. Man makes the evil explode in them. That is a good part. Man, this game does have a ton of characters. Oh, here we go. Okay. <laughs> it's a what? It's a movie. <laughs> yeah, it, it doesn't count. I remember. Yeah, this, we don't care about Garlic Jr. I remember this made me think that I had missed an arc of DBZ at some point when they would show bits of the the Garlic Jr. movie. Piccolo, you yeah. Because this was the first full arc of Dragon Ball Z that I ever watched, the Garlic Jr. Saga. Oh, really? Wow. 
So when they talked about Garlic Jr., I'm like, oh, wow, that is kind of cool. <laughs> yeah, that's a neat So background. I legitimately thought he was just part of canon. That being said, as a kid, I'm sitting there like, so this guy's as strong as Frieza, huh? <laughs> Weird. Yeah. Feel like uh, Huber's right now. He's doing big Garlic Junior voice. Yeah. And this is like one of the only games where you get to play as tiny Garlic Junior. Yeah. Which, which I really like. Like you know, I. Uh, I don't think the arc or his movie are particularly good, and it's very simple. But I like Garlic Jr.'s design. He's his just mo a, his movie's all right. Just a just a nice little imp. And then when he turns big, he's just a big imp. Yeah, his movie was like the last time Dragon Ball Z was Dragon Ball, basically. Yes. Yeah, his movie feels definitely more Dragon Ball than Z. Because they hadn't quite gotten into the full swing of like what is everybody this show powers about up and exactly gets now? transformations and. Like, the show can't change that much, right? <laughs> yeah, it was the last time power levels really mattered. Like, uh, didn't really matter. Yeah. Actually, no, uh, World's Strongest power levels weren't really a thing, except for, you know, the whole World's Strongest Man thing. <laughs> we weren't pretending to have a number system attached to it yet. Yeah. World's strongest is what ran, or uh, uh, Tree of Might is what ran that shit into the ground. I don't know where he is, but we'll find him. Tracks. Oh, found him. Time to get serious. Darkness evil beam. Is that what it's called? The darkness the eye beam or something. Oh, okay. Oh boy. Ah, avoided it. Just fuck off, Gohan. Yeah, gee, Gohan. We aren't exactly winning. Ah, uh, he's like right there. Right on the edge of the hurt box. Nope, I didn't. Which one is it that does the damage? Is that the hurt box or the hit box? Uh, it, it is your hurt box is where you can get hurt. Okay. Hit boxes are what it things. Gotcha. Fighting game terminology. Not my strong suit. And then there's the lesser known like grab box because that tr is treated differently from a hurt box. Interesting. Can't be blocked. Okay, destructive wave apparently sucks. Yeah, no more <laughs> of that. No more beams. Only only charge attacks on him. Stop blocking you, little coward! He's turtling. He's turtling hard. <laughs> oh no. Oh man. Okay, so clearly we just need to do the Bakat Katsu Kuriaku. <laughs> He's too small! And he has super armor too! Sometimes he hasn't been transformed yet. Oh, here there he goes. goes. Yay. <laughs> okay, please like, give me some help, Athens. Just, tag out, just oh. tag out to Gohan or something. Please back me up! I am! <laughs> That's not a line I like to hear. I agree! I would agree. That's why I want to get him out of here. I'm bashing. Oh no! <laughs> oh my god, that's so rude. You stay up there. Oh god! He didn't stay! He didn't stay! <laughs> Yay! Oh god. Lower. Piccolo, now is not the time to be taunting him. Like one key blast and you're fucking dead, son. Where is he? Where is he's he? Down. Where is he? Where is he's he? down. There he is. Alright, do, 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 do like a big blast at me. Or start charging or something. Oh god! No, that's not what I wanted! I was pressing the No! Here he comes. That's bad. <gasps> one, 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 one. Yes! <laughs> We're safe! Go, Krillin! Krillin! I've never been my so happy. hero! I've never been so happy to see Krillin! Where's his suit? Yeah, come on. Shouldn't he be dating Marin right now? 
Shut up, Piccolo. You need it. Here goes. Hopefully, I can at least buy you and Kami a little time. Who? What? I can help What's Kami it? got to do with this? He's fixing the Blackwater Mist thing. Expanding energy wave! I could use a new title. You're not even worth the effort. Oh, man. Oh! Oh, boy. I love he, that sound. He just got super powered up. The weird <laughs> sound they use every so often. I think that's my favorite, like, laser beam sound. For a second, I thought he was using Kamehameha. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, why? Why would he know that? He saw Goku use it and thought it was neat. Just give me a Death second. Impact! Come on, then. You're going down. First, I'm gonna hit you with this. Hopefully. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> Please don't And that's back all I've contributed. Off. Okay. Well, once Goku gets back. Also, you got that red eye going on, too. I mean, relatively. You are immortal, though. I've got pink eye. Please don't come near me. Somebody pooped on my pillow. <laughs> I feel like this arc was kind of proto, like, hey, Gohan's going to be the hero next time. Yeah. We're going to see how he do. <laughs> he didn't hit the ground, so he didn't do damage. <laughs> I was say, that animation. Uh... Oh, got him. Shoot it! I'm wiggling my arms like crazy! Just fire, please! You have to have control, Gohan! Just flailing about won't do it! What? Are you giving up already? Varukatsuramna! Ah, no more Makio Star for you! Ow, 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 ow! Oh, that time you fire it really fast. He tricked me. Oh no! He did Roshi's move. I mean, it's not very good, but I'm not gonna say it's no good. Go. I was always kind of surprised that they like didn't beat him with the evil containment wave. You know, I mean, that I know Roshi was a zombie at this point. But you think of anybody that would be useful, like, that that would be useful on this guy. Yeah. That's what Super needs to do to win back people's confidence. Bring Garlic Jr. back. Yeah. Be... I haven't watched it since the Ultra Instinct episode. Uh-oh. Oh. <laughs> I can job. steer that. Like, have you have you been keeping up with it? Oh uh, yeah, I, I've I've watched the last few. Um, the the only like thing that I really like that they did is they they kind of got out in front of it, and Vegeta basically told um, Kaba he was like, "Look, if we win, we're gonna wish your universe back. You're gonna be fine." And then Kaba, help. <laughs> and then Kaba was basically like, "All right, then we'll make a deal. If I win, I'll wish your universe back." And then Vegeta kind of just went like, "I know that's not gonna happen, but thanks for the yeah, Nate." I, I appreciate the uh, the sentiment. I just always kind of assume that if a good universe wins, that's just what's going to happen. It's like, yeah. yeah, can you just bring all those guys back? I don't think they deserve to die. <laughs> Seems a little brutal. Opponent as weak as Garlic Jr. We didn't even need Goku. Which of them gets the wish? Like, is it like... Uh, they've made it sound like that anyone who is left in the arena on the winning team gets the wish. Okay, so, so it's not like the gods of destruction are yeah. being like, okay, mine. Because Frieza's acting like, well, if I win, I'm going to wish that I'm a god of destruction or something like that. Uh, and... I always thought that would be kind of cool because, like, I, I think it was um, Topo or somebody is a god of destruction in training. Mm, yes, yeah. And I thought it would be kind of cool since Goku's clearly never going to do that if Vegeta was the god of destruction yeah, in training. That, that made way more sense to me as well because I could see him being like, no, nah, I'll do it. Yeah, yeah. I could be he a seems god. like he could be the analytical type of just like, Mm, this planet probably shouldn't be here. Voip. 
Yeah, like he could do it. Like he he could have destroy. The stones to I really hope that's where it's going. But we'll see where this is going. Next time on TFS Plays Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi Three.